it's done. Nice job, kid. Mr. Capone appreciates the quality. How did you know to call this phone in the hotel? He wants to see how you do in the deep end of the pool. I can handle it. <laughs> we'll know soon enough. Here's the rumble, kid. Sal and Carlos Senzo have been wetting their beaks in the city's liquor racket for years. But now they're trying to grab control of the city. The boss wants you to put them out of business. You want some clipped? Not yet. You see, people have been forgetting who's boss. Tony Danza? First, head over to Taylor Street and tighten the screws on the people who've been paying the Senzos for protection. We can get the Senzos later. Oh, yeah. And don't whack any civilians, okay? We don't need heat from the law. I shot two cops. Give them a bit of Chicago lightning. And a bunch right. of other guys. Gums. So you better get going. And watch your back tomorrow. The near west side is crawling with Senzo's mugs. We'll clip your ass if you're not careful. He's done joking. I'll demonstrate that later. Yeah, don't shoot. Don't, yeah, don't, yeah, don't shoot civilians. And it's not as... At least, no, there's also cops on the Senzo payroll. So, you, you're going to be shooting tons of gangsters, and you can be shooting cops, and that's fine. But civilians? Oh, no. No, that's 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 getting a little bit... That's getting a little bit messy. Anyway, five... Oh, there we are. Five shops. And I just kind of realized that the beeps seemed... I think I recognize the beeps from, uh, from Shogo. Which I think they might be like default sound effects for uh, Lith Tech engine games. Hi there, don't let me just wreck your store. And basically, as you continually do damage in the store, more and more thugs come in. You know, they come in like two or three waves. And you need to do that four more times. Oh, and I forget to mention that this level spawns random enemies in. Three at a time. One pistol, one shotgun, one Tommy gun. Continuously. Until you're done. Yeah, you get more ammunition from them, but you don't get more health and armor. Hi right, there, don't mind me. The only health and armor's in... You see in the crates lying around. Alright. 
And these guys will chip you down. If you're playing on uh, you know, anything harder than this. It's like I said, I'm just trying to get through this crap. This basically is half a warning sign. You know, like, driven to do this, you know, half is a warning sign to anyone else who want to play this, whoever that might be. And half is just... <laughs> Don't let him escape. Just bloody-minded persistence because, I mean, like, I got to all the way to, like, level after this one, and let me tell you, that's got some interesting features that I'm not going to spoil just yet. But suffice to say that it's the kind of thing where it's like, if you can actually, you know, if you can actually, like, look at all that stuff that happens and be like, okay, I'm still holding this against you, I'm still judging you for it. No, screw you. You do this. You know, kids these days are acting like they're... Kids these days are going all... Oh! Oh! It's like, oh, Black Ops 2. It's the worst first-person shooter ever made. No, you don't know bad, kid. You don't know bad games like I know bad games. Don't hurt me. This way. Did I already get that one over there? Oh, no, I didn't get this one. And now we're done with the, all that monumental amounts of busy work in this place. No, please. Or, I mean, when you get right down to it, video games, the, the video games pretty much are busy work. But I mean more in a in the meta sense.
Alright, now we got the rumpus is done with. 